Grind work progress. Imagine if you got what you want every time. No struggle, no hard work, no challenges. No hard work required. Some of you are saying that would be great. You would be weak. And then, when something hard comes up in your life, you wouldn't know how to handle it. Because you have never gone through anything that strengthens you. You cannot grow without struggle. See, many people look at struggle like it's a bad thing. Your struggle will be the gift that the world falls in love with. Nobody wants to hear the story of the man that was given everything. People want to hear the stories of men and women that endure pain and turn their struggles into a gift. Same for everybody. You want people just to feel sorry for you? Yeah, or you want people to everybody. look up to you? Do you want to be a legend? Because legends are born in the valley of struggle. One shot, baby. That's all I need, dog. It's over with for these boys, man. Can't share your vision with everybody. Man, that's something to touch on. That's a true story, man. That's another thing that I, I didn't always do. I didn't, I didn't tell everybody my business. I didn't, I didn't share my vision with everybody. It's only a handful of people that understand my vision and know my vision. Because when I speak my vision, I expect you not to be a yes man to me, but to touch and agree with me, man. Like, I want people that's going to push me into my destiny. There's not one successful person that can raise his hand and say, I did it all by myself. Made it here by myself, dog. Like, at some point along your journey, you're gonna need somebody for whatever reason. For whatever reason, man, I don't care what, like, whatever it is, it is, but there's not one person that raised his hand and said, I did it all by myself. I'm coming. I'm coming, boy. I'm coming, boy. See what I'm saying? That's just like me, you know, always talking about faith, telling people to keep going on my Instagram, but it, what, what, it nothing never happened for me. It's almost like, come on, dog, like he's still talking about this, but God has done enough for me, bro, to where people will latch on and say, you know what, man, if God did it for him, surely he can do it for me too. Because God don't have no favoritism. Favorites, man. He don't have no favorites. It's all about obedience and, and your faith, bro. That's all it's about. I tell people that all the time, it's no recipe, it's no secret. Just work hard and keep your faith be obedient, man. God's timing is perfect, but His timing can't operate in your life when you out of place. You doing stuff you know you ain't supposed to be doing. You places you know you ain't supposed to be, and you still waiting on God to bless you. God can't bless something that's out of order, bro. Let's be honest. And people want to look up to something that's real. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm a Christian, bro. I'm sold out for Jesus, and I'm unashamed, bro. You know what I mean? Like I, I can, I can, I can go well with atheists. You know, I can fit in, but I'm not gonna compromise to their level. You see what I'm saying? The sinner, the person that's drunk. Talking about women, like, I can vibe with them, but I'm not going to compromise to their level. But I'll bring my light in those dark areas. Well, somebody got their work cut out, boy. Somebody got their work cut out, cuz. Squad business. I promise you, I ain't out here for no likes. I promise you that. Somebody got their work cut out, boy. Woo! That's the day. Ernie camp around the corner next week. I can have it, big fella. You hungry? This right here, cuz. This will make some folks reevaluate some stuff. Real talk. <laughs> Real talk, man. Listen to me. What I do, it'll make some folks reevaluate some stuff, cuz. True story. <sighs> Gotta be done. Let's do it. Hard but it's fair. Hard but it's fair. Oh! Man, that's why I want to start a camp, but I'm real passionate about starting a camp. It's called like, zero handouts. Yeah. Zero handouts for boys and men. Because at the end of the day, I want to work on the real demand, demand the, the individual. Mm -hmm. you know, the faith side of your, your, like, your lifestyle, your mentality. I want to polish that up. And then when we get on the field, 
I want I want I want to make you go back home to your mama and say, hey, I think I want to do this. Yeah. That's the whole goal. Yeah. I'll run you off. Yeah. That's my goal. Try to run boys off yeah. in this camp. And that's gonna make it a little bit different in every other camp. You got these feel good camps that, that bring nice players, big time guys, and give them a t-shirt and, and yeah. got dang sign Jerry, all that old crap. And now I want to make people reevaluate, man. Yeah. Is this really it? If it ain't, you need to go and pack it we up. We need more men like you, man. Really, there ain't too many guys out here that's, that's passionate about stuff they do. You know, yeah. a lot of people, like you said earlier, they just, just give it to them. You know, most of these guys just got it. They ain't willing to work for it. They just got it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it sucks for guys that really come out here and put the work in. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So, yeah. yeah. That's the thing that drives me. I ain't going to say no names, but it's a guy. He actually he has to play for the Ravens and then you receive him. Uh, he was training, man, and all he was doing was complaining, bro. Complaining. You know, he got him a nice paycheck, whatever. All he's doing the whole time was complaining, bro. Like, and he's like, man, I don't even want to go back to camp, bro. Like, I had to tap that boy. I was like, well, hey, bro, don't go back. Yeah. <laughs> I'm saying to myself, he just don't know that. That's my yeah, spot. That's, yeah, that's, that's, that's why I'm finna end up. Yeah. Don't go back. That's fine. Stay at the crib, bro. You ain't got to do this. You know what I'm saying? You ain't got to do this, bro. You know what I'm yeah. saying? If you're going to complain the whole workout, bro, you should have stayed at the house. You know what I'm saying, bro? Yeah. Like, you, 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 that's poison to the man beside you. He probably tired and ready to tap. He hear you saying that. You like, just go home, pack it up, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But it is what it is. Like it just it just pissed people off that's trying to do something, bro. And here you is, you doing it and you taking it for granted, bro. You ain't grateful, bro. Yep. Grind work progress.